Hey, Tim N7 KOM here, and my favorite radio for summits on the air is the Yezu FT60R. Now, I've really only used this HT for doing simplex soda stuff, even though I have a bunch of repeaters programmed into here. So, I'm going to do a short little video series here where we explore all the features of the FT60R and do a deep dive of how to use this radio. Stay tuned. Okay, starting with basics here, covering the uh, top and front panel. The top has an SMA female connector, which you can use with the supplied uh, rubber duck antenna here. Next knob is your on and off volume knob. It clicks and turns on and turns the volume up and clicks to turn off. Our next knob here the outer ring is our squelch. And the inner knob is a selector switch which you can use to access different uh, memory options and also uh, scroll through your different programmed uh, memories. On a VFO mode, uh, scroll through your different frequencies. And finally on the top we have a little LED which will turn green if the channel is busy and turn red if we are transmitting. And on our front face here, we have, of course, our LCD display, speaker, microphone, and the touchpad, which we use to access a lot of the operating features of the radio. On the left side of the radio, we have our push to talk button, our monitor call button, and our lamp button. Of course, push to talk is to transmit, and the monitor uh, call button we can use to temporarily open the squelch. And then the lamp button we can use to uh, temporarily illuminate the LCD. On the right side of the radio, we have a mic slash speaker input, and then a external DC power source. All right, that's gonna be it for this episode, so please like and subscribe to follow along with the rest of the series. 7-3.